Since we both single, why the fuck not? I hit hard bars, you can't tell me nothing. Spit fire, burning shit like a fucking toaster. Your main bitch wanna pull me closer. <laughs> Take the damn fork out. There you go. Go like this. What's good, Mo Mafia? It's your girl, Mo. And Jennifer. And we back with another banger. And as y'all hey. can tell by the title, today we're doing our coming out stories. So basically, how we came out and told our family we was gay. We got some Panda Express, as y'all can see. Yes, this is my first time eating. She talked me into eating this. <laughs> what did I want to eat? Tell them now, because they're going to be on she me. She said she wanted Jack in the Box uh, chicken salad with two tacos. You what? wasn't supposed to tell the taco part? <laughs> <laughs> she irritating. But yeah, we got some um, Panda Express, and we about to go in. So we're going to pray yeah. real quick, because I almost dug in. God is good. God is great. And we thank him for this food. We're going to thank hey. him in the morning, noon, and night. Because God, God, God is dynamite. I'm at... I'm at... Game. Now, y'all, I got... What's this called? Uh, chow meat. Chow, chow mein. Chow mein noodles. Have, have, have rice. I got orange chicken and honey walnut shrimp. What you got, Jen? Um, got some orange chicken. <laughs> And some steak with some fried rice and some chow mein mm. and some hot sauce. Mm, oh, good, y'all. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I know this ain't healthy, but I ain't ate all day. This is my first meal, y'all. Give me a break now. Mm -hmm. I tried to get salad, but somebody just insisted with them two tacos. <laughs> so what? I got a big water right here in the middle of it. Mm -hmm. I swear to God, that's water. <laughs> Why you lying? I'm All right. Playing. You want me to go first on my story? Or yeah, you go, go ahead. First? Go first. No, ladies first. You go first. Mm -hmm. No, gentlemen's first. Gentle, gentle woman first. Gen <laughs> <laughs> a uh, woman. Go. You the gentle woman. Your name Jen though. That has nothing to do with gentle. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. So, y'all, let me go ahead and start first, right? When I mm. came out, I came out to my dad. You came military. out to your daddy? And came out military? Oh, yeah, he was in the Marine Corps, so the fucked up part was um, almost got locked up so I had to like really tell the truth and tell my dad why I'm getting locked up and who I'm getting locked up with that's Man. how I came out I told that him I not, what happened tell the story okay um he did trying to eat hell yeah this food good mm -hmm. I forgot what I was gonna say y'all you tell the story how you came out like what happened so I got pulled over Mm -hmm. And um, I was young at the time. I was 17 years old and um, drunk driving. Mm -hmm. But see, the police officer didn't get me for that because they smelled marijuana in the car. So they tried to get me for that. But they didn't really smell the alcohol. But I know I was fucked up though. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I know I was fucked up. I know I was fucked up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, they made us come out the car. Mm -hmm. They started searching the vehicle. And they found... One nut. An eighth of weed in the car. And they decided to want to take us to jail. Mm-hmm. And this was the girl that I was dating at the time. It was her weed? No. It was your? It was my weed. Mm. So, they searched the car, they found the weed, and they took both of us to jail, and they told us to call our parents and let them know we're getting locked up. Mm-hmm. And then, 
I called my dad. I got a question, Jim. What happened? I didn't mean to interrupt you. Mm. This is so good. But how did you have to tell him you was gay behind getting locked up? Like, you could have said, this is my friend from school or this is my homegirl. How did you end up having to tell him you was gay? Because the person I was with, when I was on the phone, she was right there next to me, so I couldn't say she was my friend. <laughs> <laughs> Loyal. Period. This bae. There you go. I'm with bae. When we so, locked up, come get me, daddy. Yes, that part. And that's how I ended up letting my dad know I mm. was gay. Mm. Now, Mo. Mm. How did they find out? Okay, so, I mean, come on, it, it, look, I, it already looked obvious, so. <laughs> I wasn't like this in high school. Well, I was, I was a tomboy, but I had, like, a perm, my hair was down. Let me find out you was wearing dresses and No, I, was, I never wore dresses, like, since mm. I was younger, like, never. You couldn't, I wore a dress one time, and that was my sister wedding, because I was, a, um, what they call it? When you too big for the flower girl, but you not old enough to be a bridesmaid, it's in the middle of that. The junior's bridesmaid. No, not junior's bridesmaid. It's, it's, it's something else where you, like, pass out the uh, pamphlets and stuff. No, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't remember what it's called. But I came out to my mama. Well, I didn't come out to my mama. She found some stuff. Well, let me tell y'all. I'm going to try to stop eating for a minute. Okay, so this is what happened, y'all. This is what happened. Sorry, I spilled some water on myself. <coughs> so, in high school, I was talking to girls, woo woo woo. Um, I never brought no girls home. But eventually, I gathered a crowd of friends. So it's like everybody came over to kick it. You know what I'm saying? So um, we had all came over. We was kicking it. Woo, woo, woo. I guess my mama kind of noticed, like, we was kind of flirty and stuff. So weeks went by. Weeks went by. One day, I don't know where I was going to, but I was gone. I was gone somewhere, and I came home, and my mama was cleaning my room. So I walk in my room, my mama holding my purple <laughs> slang madang, period. Get in the camera, Jen, you ain't in the camera. Oh, you is in the camera. I am in the camera. Just a little bit. Yeah, you just want me in the camera and everything. So they can see you eat your food. Get them some. Mm, that's sexy, ain't it? Mm. What the hookie? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so my mama holding it, she said, what the fuck is this? And if y'all knew my mama, that's exactly how she sounded. She said, what is this? I said, ma, why are you in my stuff? Why are you going through my stuff? She said, you freaky ass Scorpio bitch. That's exactly what she called me. I can call my mama to this day and ask her. Matter of fact, I'm finna call my mama and be like, ma, you remember when you... You remember when you found my dildo in my room? Because <laughs> people be thinking I be lying about this story. I ain't lying. Let me call my mama. I'm literally finna call my mama, bro. It's just so funny, like, the way it happened. And then, you know what I'm saying? After she found it or whatever, she just start asking me questions like, what do you use it for? Like, is it for yourself? Or are you pleasing your... I'm like, no, ma. I never did that. And you know that. Like, she knew I was a virgin and everything. And then she was just like, so who do you, what do you need it for? I'm like, ma, because I like girls, I'm gay. Mm. She was like, I already knew. That's like what I she said, said. She said she already knew. I would have been, I would have been known. It's too obvious. <laughs> Shut up, G. You irritating. But yeah, I'm going to call my mama and ask her. Look at your grandma. She might say something crazy, y'all. My mama is crazy. Calling moms. <laughs> Answer the phone, mom. 
Now this is my real mom, mom calling. Hey, ma. How you been? Why oh, you sound sad? You okay? Oh, okay. I called to ask you a question. I'm shooting this video for my YouTube channel, and I'm basically telling them how I came out to my family. Do you remember when you found my dildo in my room while you was cleaning it up? Yes. <laughs> Ma, do you remember it? Remember, or are you just saying yes? shooting this video I just wanted to prove that I wasn't lying nobody I just wanted to prove to my subscribers that I that I was telling the truth <laughs> all right I love you bye damn she said even in the back she said she found two I forgot about that one bro Cause I, you know, you gotta have flavor. You gotta have different flavors for the ladies. Period. So y'all, all in all, she found she found my little stuff I had at the time, and she was like, "I already knew. I already knew." And it's crazy, cause every like three of my ex boyfriends, y'all, like a lot of people know this, but a lot of people don't know this. Are trans? Are three of my ex boyfriends are transgender? Like living as a woman right now, and that just proved to me even further. Like, dude, why all your ex boyfriends women now? Ain't that crazy? What you thinking know. about? You daydreaming? Why you a stud? Hmm? Why you a stud? That's what you thinking about? Close to being a guy, which is oh yeah, crazy. right. Oh okay, yeah, yeah. Ain't that crazy though, y'all? Hella crazy, ain't it? Life is funny. Y'all, if y'all can get this video to 3,000 likes, I'll do a video with my ex, who's in Phoenix, living as a transgender woman. If y'all can get this video to 3,000 likes, I'll do a, a mukbang with my ex, Boyfriend who's now a woman. Mm. You think they can do it, Jim? You think Mo Mafia got, got it in them? Of course. <laughs> Why would they not? <laughs> Jim, you part of Mo Mafia. It's all good. We know. We love Mo. What was that look? Oh, that's a green bean. String bean. Mmm. Good, ain't it? Hell yeah. Good as hell. So you ever figured out who's been in your um in your bag all that time? You took one sausage. They was on my butt about that <laughs> on their last video. Hey, my team didn't even take but one sausage. <laughs> you know, girl, I felt like I had more than this, but I realized. And if y'all haven't watched that video with me, Jen, and Ian, we did a hot and juicy crawfish mukbang. I'll leave it right here in the corner. I'll leave a marker. Yeah, she was telling me that uh, I was taking all her sausages and her corn. Man, I thought Jim was taking my food, but I realized I only got a half serving of sausage because Ian didn't want none. And, you know, at first I didn't know you was going to be eating with us until I called you while I was there. And I was, I was like, oh, let me get another uh, glove and um, bib. Mm -hmm. But I'm like, there's more than enough food for all of us. Mm -hmm. it was. I was up. Mm. That was so good. And we still had some left behind. Mm-hmm. Everybody in the neighborhood was eating that shit. Yep. <laughs> but yeah, my mafia, that's my coming out story. I guess mine was good because I hear a lot of people saying, you know, they be scared to come out to their parents and they don't want to be judged and all this. My message to y'all. Don't be. Don't be. You have one life to live. And if you're not true to yourself, then who else will be? Right, that part. So if you're gay and you're watching this and you're wondering like, man, what am I going to do? How am I going to tell my mama? How am I going to tell my daddy? 
In all but actuality, if they are one of them crazy parents, right? I understand that's that. trying to kill you. You better run. <laughs> Listen, but in all actuality, you don't have to. Just live your life, and when when the time comes, it'll come. You can tell them. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So for all my subscribers who are young and you think you attracted to the same sex, just take it slow. Don't don't go jumping into stuff, having sex and doing all that. That doesn't prove you're gay. No. Nope. Cause guess what? I know I'm gay. And I've never been with a man. And I put that on everything I love. I've never had sex with a guy. I'm a whole version out here. Well not with a <coughs> Y'all know what I mean. No comment. <coughs> What's that supposed to mean? I'm talking about myself. <laughs> oh, oh, I was gonna say, girl, I am a virgin. Yeah, a whole time and a half. Yeah, yeah. But you know, because that don't prove that you're gay. I know that I'm attracted to women. I know that I've been in love with women. A guy just, I couldn't do it. I came close. It almost happened, but I was like, nah, bruh. You gotta get up off me, bruh. I feel weird, bruh. Like, like you put put your pants back on, bro. He had on drawers, but no pants. I'm like, oh no. And you know what's crazy? The ex that I'm gonna do the mukbang with is the one. So get this video to 3,000 likes, y'all. And me and my ex, who's now transgender, will do a video together. And maybe we'll tell that story. I don't know. I wanna see y'all kiss. What? I mean, she's a girl now, so why not? No. I don't just go around kissing people. I don't know where her mouth is. <laughs> mm -mm. That'll probably give you some a lot of ratings. <laughs> I ain't desperate for uh, views like that. I'm not desperate for views at all. Because I know God got me. Hey. No, I'm full. Me too. Then you pull Jen in her whole plate. Show them, Jen. Look at my plate, y'all. Mo, sh show them your plate. <laughs> I'm full. Mmm, it's so good. Mm-hmm. I can't even stop eating it. I had I this out here a couple times, and it wasn't all that. And it's good now. All right, y'all. It was nice chopping it up and everything, you know. <laughs> like Mo said, don't be afraid to tell your parents because right. at the end of the day, it's going to come out regardless because what's in the dark will come out the light. Period. Period. I love y'all, Mo Mafia. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, hit that bell so y'all know when I'm dropping bangers. And when I say hit that bell, I mean hit that bell because some of y'all always be late. Oh, man, I missed something. Hit that bell, man, so y'all know when I'm uploading and... Mo Mafia, we gonna get lit cause we the shit. Gang. Yeah. I'm looking hella good right now though. Oh, snackarooski. I know, right? Where's all the females at though? For real, for real. Jen. Since we both single, why the fuck not? <laughs> Period. Alright, y'all, we out. Peace. <laughs>